or themes so far. It, it feels like like another Ruby Sapphire game. Welcome to the Vendom Town Gym. I'm the gym guy. Felina, the gym leader, specializes in poison type Pokemon. In that case, I recommend using ground or psychic type Pokemon. But first, if you wish to reach Felina, you have to solve the puzzle. Each room has four tanks of highly corrosive poison. So corrosive that they have different colors. Your task is to mix those poisons together and create a new color. Once you've mixed different types of poison, you can check it. You can check if you did it correctly by interacting with the monitor. Quite simple, right? Good luck. Oh, and before you go, that's take this. Not, that's not at all dangerous in any way whatsoever. That no actually sounds like a creative gem puzzle. Also, let's check the town map now that we have actually been through half the region. Half the region? Not half the region. You know what I mean. Okay. Um, let's go ahead and get going then, shall we? Is there any inactive term? Bruh. At wait, no, but what's what's the color that I have to? Oh, if you give me a hint, if you beat me, I'll give you a hint for the solution. All right, we're taking notes. One shot, not not surprising. Yeah. Alright, what's the hint? Give it to me. You need to mix two poisons. Okay, two poisons. I totally don't need to take notes probably for this first one. But That's the hint? That's way too obvious of a hint. And there's three wait. Calculate this no. Oh, so we have to beat the trainers to get the hints. Okay. Yeah. Ooh, no, I'm just kidding. Atkins? Oh, wait, this is wait, a poison type. What? Type. <laughs> what? What were you about to say? I said boo. Oh. Like, I, I don't like that I have to battle you. Oh. My mind's in the gutter, clearly. Your mind is in the gutter. Mashi, no, not not the hydrate. I have no water left. <laughs> Fuck, I have to go get water now. Okay. In front of you, the, the people. <laughs> I know, and I have to talk to them now. <laughs> this could be a while, folks. I'll Akira, be right back, what have you done? Anyways, I did not even speak to you. Wait, I'll give you a little hint. You need to mix certain poisons to make a sunset color solution. It needs to be sunset color. Well, so, so fun fact, I don't, surely it's the pink and orange, right? Surely it's the pink and orange. For sunset? This is not gray, or wait, that one's empty. Solution accepted. Cool. I was gonna say. So next room. Oh, here we go. So we're just gonna continually have to... I totally forgot to heal, too. Damn it! We're still paralyzed, aren't we? Yep. Cool. Luckily, all you know is fucking absorb. Ooh, okay, well, catch this mock punch real quick. I'm not gonna make the joke. I swear, I'm not gonna make the joke. Hmm. What's the Pokemon coming in here? <laughs> well, it was, it left us as quickly as it, as it, got thrown in. You got a little hint. You need to mix two po Stop with the two poison bullshit! There's gonna be one where I have to mix all four, I'm sure. Stop. 
Donkey. Okay. I still haven't. My belt trigger is so weird. I'm still paralyzed too. How cool is that? How cool is that that I completely forget to heal my Pokemon? It's lovely, isn't it? Nope, I'm not switching again. Um, okay, pull those. I'm wondering how far we are into the demo and like how much longer it would take us to like finish it. Cause like I would totally try and finish this tonight if it's not too much longer. Like I have nowhere to be. Like all, all of my time commitments tomorrow happen after like 5 p.m. so. Though I do have stuff that I need to do before that, but like... Yeah, I'm asleep in. Come on now. Hm. Alright, what do you have to say? Certain potions to make a wealth and prestige color solution. Um, okay. I'm gonna act like I know what that means. I'm gonna act like I know what that means. Where is... Where's my berries? A cherry berry? There we go. And then... Use your brain, Cade. Actually, it's not that difficult. Pur yeah, I was thinking purple, right? Wealth and prestige? But, like, it could also totally be, like, gold. Oh, I bet it's purple and gold, maybe? Oh, that's maroon. Maroon, teal... Oh, that one's inactive. And well, surely gold's one of them. And then you would assume mar maroon? That's not really what maroon looks like either. But I can't see how it would be teal and gold. Yeah. Cool. All right. Oh, look at that. It's gym leader time. Okay, well. Let's see here. Do I want to lead off with Hothead, or do I want to lead off with Cage? Um, I'm thinking we probably just lead off with Cage? Probably? I don't know, we'll see. We are at the level cap, so... I'm feeling fairly confident. Hey, Cade. You really want that badge, huh? Well, then show me you're worth it. I mean, it's just the, the logical thing to do. Kato... Kajo Raid 5. There you go. There's a regional slugma. I want that thing. So we, we've got the Surskit and we've got the slugma. I need both of those. Out of my team. Glimmit. Wait, Glimmit's from... Haha, funny joke. This thing's from uh, from Scarlet Violet, is it not? This is the pre-evo to the, the Champion's Ace, right. And it gets the ancient power boosts. You're kidding me. But whatever. And that's right, this thing has toxic debris. And Beedrill. Well, don't mind if I do. Let's go into our fire type. It's finally here, my last hope. And let's go ahead, Ember. Oh, but we did. Oh, we got. Oh, I kind of like that. That's cool. So you get you get the the toxic spikes down, and then the Beedrill has a Venom shot. I see. I see. Um. Are you just gonna keep using Venom Shock? Huh. Well, so this isn't gonna work now. So we're gonna have to go into. We don't have a poison type to eat up the that shit, so that's kind of unfortunate. 
Poison Sting? Okay, cool. Rather have you use Poison Sting than Venom Shock. Bug Bite? That's fine too. Wait, why didn't it bite the berry? The fuck? Interesting. Speed fell. Not that that matters. I mean, that might matter. Oh, that's right! Pickup also has an in-battle effect. I forgot about that. That's cool. Goodbye, Beedrill. Carried by Fan P. Absolutely carried by Fan P. Baby doll eyes? No. <laughs> Fuck that. You beat me. There's only one time to learn baby doll eyes. And that's when you're trying to evolve into a Sylveon in <laughs> Gen 6. Congratulations, you've earned the Toxic Badge. Now you can use the HM Cut outside of battle. Take this TM too. TM for Venoshock. I wish you the best of luck on your grand adventure. Thank you, thank you, thank you. That's right, that's not a door there. Alright. There we go. I wonder when we're going to get a sense of story coming up then. Because I feel like it's it's about that time, right? We've gotten, we've gotten the badge. I feel like it's time for the story to come in at some point, right? Um, and I do find it interesting how, like, I don't know, especially this town, it just didn't feel like there was much going on in it other than like just the the berry house like i feel like if you may, wanted to make the town feel just a little bit more alive you could have just added like a few npcs that talk about that like talk about like i don't know how this place has like such a booming berry business for and like it it serves fruit and berries for the whole region or something like that and, like that would be pretty simple just a suggestion Anyways, continue. The entrance to Fructus for Forest is blocked by a tree. How frustrating. I wonder if there's a way to clear the path. I need to go to Merco City. Bug catcher? Okay, cool. Cool bugs in the forest. Well, here, here's what I will say. I know I was complaining a lot before about fire type having to go through a cave, but hey, now we've got a fire type and we're facing so many bug catchers it's not even funny and this thing has flash fire i forgot about that damn um okay wait you probably resist that don't you yeah we should probably switch out interesting you can get a scissipede though i would totally use one if i'm not if i wasn't already using uh chimchar here or not chimchar inferno <laughs> Uh, let's go bulldoze. Down goes the Sizzlipede. And Dotler. Ooh, okay. I see you. I do actually really like this evolution. One of the best... <laughs> One of the best things to come out of Sword and Shield, the regional bug. I thought I was gonna, like, drop this dude off of the team so many times, and he just, and this thing just keeps, Orbeetle just keeps coming in clutch. Like, it got, it had Struggle Bug, it had both screens, like, it was, it's such a good utility mount in game. Get rid of Scratch for Fury Swipe too. Then goes Bug Catcher Andrew. Okay. Um, let me use some fresh waters. There we go, there we go, there we go. I also wonder. Oh! Um... Cool! Hey! Are we battling this dude now? You got your first badge? Great, me too. I hope you're up for another battle. Let's go. 
Yeah, I swear that his versus sprite is like stretched horizontally there. It starts off with a rock rough, okay. Let's go with Hothead. That is an Oko right there. Damn. Staravia? I got a Pokemon just for you. Just for you. Let's go ahead, Thundershock. Goodbye. Level 16 on Fabio wants to learn charge. No, thank you. Raditz is level 16, wants to learn Stun Spore. Um, I mean, we don't really have a need for Absorb anymore. And Marsh Stomp is the next Pokemon in here. Let's go into Raditz. You've gotten a lot stronger since we met. Yeah, I mean, you also have an Evolve. Level 17, that, that's that's certainly a level jump. Good thing I have a Pokemon that's quite effective against you. You know what would also be interesting? I think that you could also look to put into this game because I think also the difficulty isn't like, it's not super difficult right now. Um, it would be interesting because you just had the city that like had the berry shop is especially with like the marsh stomp what if the marsh stomp had like the grass resist berry or whatever so like when he gets hit by a super effective grass type move that berry procs and he doesn't take as much damage just like an idea obviously i think that'd be like kind of interesting and also kind of like would marry the region and gameplay like a little bit I guess. Level 17 here on Raditz. And halfway to level 18. Nice. What a battle! Okay, there's something I need to tell you. I've seen some shady characters. Oh, here we go. It's story time. That's the plan. Got it? I suppose so. I wonder if you're evil. Out of the way, kids. We have work to do. Those were the people I was talking about. We should investigate what they're doing. Okay, I'll head over there right now. I'll wait for you in the forest. Oh, do we have... Do we have partner mechanic? Do we have partner mechanic? Wait, so... This... We actually have to have a Pokemon with cut for this thing, but not for the... First one? Interesting. Um, as much as I don't want to teach Cut to Oddish... Actually, let's first... No, I... Give up on learning Cut. First, I want to check what the encounters are. We still... Okay, so it looks like we need to wait for Night for the Surse Kit to be a possible encounter. And then it just hit 8 a.m. <laughs> Fantastic. Fantastic. Um, I mean, I guess we could probably catch a Pokemon to for HM use. Oh, there's a Tyrogue in here? Okay. Interesting. Not interested, but... Um, I do like Tyrogue, and I do like its evolutions. I think we'll probably just chill for right now with this dude up in front. And also, we must have to come out of the forest on the other side or something. Early Hitmons? Yeah, early Hitmons? Be kind of crazy. Like, that thing evolves at level 20? That'd be pretty busted. Though, you'd have to get the Tyrogue to up to level 20, which, I mean, you do have the experience all, so it wouldn't be horrible, but... Also... Ooh. Tyrogue is not a fun Pokemon to train. Just another Marie. I do think the Pokemon selection is 
pretty diverse and interesting here, though. So, um, definitely got to say it's been really good. Yeah, okay. I think we're just gonna have to... We're just gonna have to break down and teach somebody cut. I mean, not that we need to teach cut to somebody, but, you know. I mean, I could get rid of... Mm, mm, I mean, fuck it. We'll just get rid of growth. I just don't feel like growth necessarily fits that moveset. So, yeah, we'll do that. Also, I guess I never looked at our other... Watch Oddish be able to learn Venoshock. Yeah. Of course. Yeah. <laughs> of course. And now I want to get rid of Cut for that. Have fun. Well, whatever. We'll, At least we'll, we'll, we'll catch that Slugma and then we'll teach it Venoshock. If only HM moves were, you know, deletable. Yeah. Or just like, we just ha got like an HM item instead. Hmm. Charcoal, or just like if the HM was, like I actually didn't know that hurt? for a, a really long time. What? At HM that you couldn't forget HM moves. And then the one time you wanted it to happen, you were like, "Oh shit, what's going on?" Yep. Andy, what's yep. up? How are the jam games coming along? They we're we're having a swell time here with Pokemon Nightmare. I'm having a blast. How are you doing? This game is pretty good so far. Okay, that's right, we literally have to go into the forest. Okay. Yeah, wait, partner mechanic? Are you ready to go together? Yes! So what, what do the encounters look like in this forest? We can get the Surskit. Doing fine, but the abstract team is working hard to get rid of bugs. They're literally wild megas in the grass because of level scaling stuff. Oh no. Also, ECAT, there are wild pineco here. Just a just a heads up, your your wish could still come true. Do not to in Flabebe. Again, the Pokemon selection here is great. Forgot about Natsu. And Zatsu. Yeah. I guess we have Bug Catcher. And Full Baby, actually. Then again, there's so freaking many Pokemon now. Yeah. I do have to get... Dude, I still have to make my fucking list. I don't even think I'll make that tonight. I'll just be making that... Probably tomorrow? Oh, I thought this was wild Pokemon for a second, and I got really excited, and then I was like, shit. Also, 2v1 battles? Really? That is a mean-looking Surskit. Yeah, that's why I want it. <laughs> that's because it's a regional. Well, that is a bug, I guess? I mean, he only had one Pokemon. So... Oh, look who's up next, Mr. Grunt Boy. Get out of here. No. Bugs Bunny meme. No. No. I'm not familiar with that meme. No way. I refuse to believe. I mean, maybe... Let me look. Let me look. Oh my god, I did not... No, I'm not going to know your meme. Just... Open. Oh, yes. Yes, I do. Yeah, I was going to say. I haven't seen it in a, a long very time. long time. It's one of my favorites. <laughs> that rival's arm is kind of busted. I was not paying attention. Um, the, the only When I think of Bugs Bunny memes, the only one that comes to mind immediately is the, uh, the like, Soviet Union one. <laughs> that one is pretty funny. And, of course, Big Chungus. God about big chungus, bro. Oh my god. 
Who is that? I I remember Kenny asked me to nickname somebody. Oh, it was the it was the Gorichi we had in uh, Infinity. We called it Big Chunkus. Also, Cage is being targeted right now. And here you are using fucking Leer. Sprite position isn't correct, so I'll fix that later. The sprite position also on the player sprite isn't correct. But luckily there's been nothing super serious. Oh, we survived that. Let's go. There's been nothing that's been like... Game breaking or anything I would consider like you have to fix. Oh, there you go. This isn't like my double battles and or my alter battles and flux, where the other Pokemon literally doesn't do any fucking damage. Um, sleep powder or stun spore? I like stun spore more. Down you go. Oh, these guys have names? Also, I totally missed their team name as well. So I'll have to take a look at that. Am I lost? Nah, bruh. Team... Epiltus? Ep I... Yeah. <laughs> I'm not going to be able to pronounce that one. Okay, so I see this team is just anti-Monferno. That's really good. Cool. I'm joking. I'm joking. That we do need fun. to catch a dark type, though. You definitely need to catch a dark type. Maybe we can get an Umbreon. Wait, I wonder if that Surskit is bugged on. Y'all need to calm down. Stop targeting me with this shit. Oh my god. There we go. Another shot down goes the drowsy. There we go. Oh, rip rock rough. It doesn't get experience. Yikes. Not that it matters to me, it's not mine. Flame wheel? Yes, please. We are literally adamant natured. I want to get rid of my special moves. Speaking of natures, did you see that thing I posted? Yeah, and honestly, I don't really care about natures either. <laughs> well, no, I do care about natures. But I don't care about EVs and IVs. Okay, thank you. Especially, well, like, stuff for, like, competitive I do, but, like, I don't play competitive anymore. Because it's just... I, I've said it before, I'll say it again. I don't understand a turn-based battle system being competitive. <laughs> I just don't get it. I mean, it's... And again, I that's kind of cool, like D&D, but... isn't it? I mean, I don't know how Isn't competitive like, D&D is. If, and again, tabletop RPGs are a thing, so... I guess that does make sense, but... It's not really what I think of when I think of competitive video gaming. I mean, yeah, I don't think of Pokemon as competitive video gaming, but... It very I mean, much it's, is. If, if it's your cup of tea, go for it. I don't... To me, playing an RPG... A, like, like a, something so, like... With even any semblance of luck... Is like playing competitive Smash Bros with items turned on. Damn, bro. This dude is out for Rock Rock. <laughs> like, am I stupid for that having that line of thinking? There are a lot of people that like Pokemon competitively. Yeah. 
I mean, I used to like Pokemon competitively, then I, I don't know, found other games that I liked being competitive in. Actually, World no, then I, then I just lost my competitive spirit. To me, you guys know like, the World okay. Championships are on this week. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, I've, I've, I've noticed that. I'm, like, good at Pokemon, if I can, like, lose, like, literally lose money to a random critical hit, like, isn't that just gambling? <laughs> no, because I feel like it's more based... I feel like it's more based on skill than luck, though. It's more based on making reads.